I should come up with a jingle. I'm Jess. What's up, stud? What's wrong? Hi, my name's Juice. Jess. Everybody calls me Juice, though. Um, if you're wondering why people call me Juice, that's a good question. It's just because I'm juicy. There's a story behind it, but that's for another time. So, I wanted to start a YouTube channel since I was like 12 years old, and I'm actually pretty thankful that that didn't happen because I don't even wanna know what would be in those videos. When I was younger, all my friends like had these YouTube channels and they're like, I have like 200 subscribers. One time, I was in like eighth grade, maybe even seventh grade, I'm walking with my friends and this one friend was like, um, she's a cheerleader, she's a YouTuber, and I'm this, like... What's your claim to fame in this school? <laughs> I'm Juice. <laughs> I think that's before people even called me Juice. Yeah, I don't know if I'm like a little bit late to the YouTube game, but... I mean, I know I am. But here we go. Yes. People have been telling me for years that I should make a YouTube channel, and I was like, you know what, you're probably right, because I post- <laughs> I'm just a strange person in general, and I post a lot of funky, weird, I, I don't know how to explain them, a lot of <laughs> strange snapchats. Every once in a while I cringe at my own snap, but I have friends who have been like, you should start a YouTube channel, and I'm like, I've been meaning to for like, five, when was I 12? Six years ago? Shit. That was a long time ago. But here I am now in 2017. Sorry, 2012 and 13 and 14 and 15. So, I have a dog named Marley. I just thought I should share that because it's a very important part of who I am as a person. Um, a little joke I like to say. So. People will ask what my dog's name is, or I'll just be like, uh, they might not ask, but I'll be like, yeah, my dog's named after Bob Marley. <laughs> and they're like, oh, her name's Marley? And I'm like, no, it's Bob. <sighs> no, I'm originally from Georgia, Atlanta, Georgia. I was born there and I grew up in a pretty little suburb next to it. And then when I was like eight-ish kind of, I moved to New Jersey, the Jersey Shore. So uh, if you're keeping up to date with MTV, they're making a spinoff, the Floribama Shore. It's kind of a knockoff. I mean, Floribama, that's basically Georgia, like Florida, Alabama border, but it's just fake. Like, <laughs> there's not gonna be another Snooki. I'm just watching, I'm just watching all these things that happened to the Jersey Shore characters over the years, and it's like, these people don't know what they're getting into. I almost, I talked to the producer of that show, and he was interested. Then he was like, how old are you? And I was like, 18, and he was like, you're not drinking age. And I was like, no, literally, it's just a show about getting drunk and doing dumb things. I go to the seaside boardwalk with my friends sometimes. That's just, how it is. I prefer Point Pleasant though because that's more family friendly. So now I live in New York City because I go to college and I'm wearing a shirt that says La Jolla. One of my sweet mates is from La Jolla but this is not why I have this. I actually have this because my mom went to La Jolla when she wanted to get pregnant because she heard that because like if you go on vacation to get pregnant you're more likely to get pregnant. I've said pregnant, 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 pregnant. Pregnant a lot of times in this sentence. So she went there and bought this La Jolla sweatshirt and here I am 18 years later. Actually, wait, no, I wasn't. I don't know if it worked. Oh God. I'm wearing my conception sweatshirt. It's fine. I go to Manhattan College. I'm 18 years old. Um, I'm a communications major. I think I'm majoring in studying again? I'm not studying, I'm procrastinating. That's what's happening right now. <sighs> Journalism and broadcasting, but maybe PR or advertising. I don't know. I just like communication. I want to be a model and actress. That's 
what I want to do. I don't know if you can see my disco ball from over there, but it's really dusty, but it's cute. So I do not have a roommate, which is probably good because <laughs> I like to make noise a lot. I, wow, okay. I play music all the time. I sing. I play ukulele and guitar a lot. And like just all the time. And I don't think that a roommate would appreciate that. My sweet mates in the other room, even they hear me sometimes. That's when I'm like, ooh, I need to chill. Enjoy sunsets and long walks on the beach. I know my air conditioner is probably really loud right now, but it's right below the window and this is where the best lighting is. And I'm not gonna sacrifice the good lighting. Now I'm a little bit cold because it's on. I'm not really sure where I'm going with this channel yet, to be honest. I definitely will come up with some ideas. I had like a whole ton of ideas in my old phone, but I just got a new phone a couple weeks ago and I forgot to back up my Oh god, I'm sliding through. Why don't you slide through? I got a new phone a couple weeks ago and it doesn't have any of my notes in it. So all of those things that I came up with since I was 12 are gone. That's probably for the better. My dreams are acting and modeling as a famous person. That was very vague. And yeah, I'm just out here living my best life and out of all the seven views that this is gonna get, I hope like I just want to know, want you to know <laughs> that I love and care for each and every single one of you, all two of you. I know that my friends are probably gonna cringe at this. <laughs> I'm gonna cringe at this, but uh, I'm just. Oh God, it's happening! Oh, oh. how far back? Can I go? I'm gonna hurt myself. I'm just gonna. Oh god. Oh god. Oh, why did I do that? Oh god. Yeah, I also work out. I think that I should finish with a video of my dog.